Hey everyone, it's me Trin, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys my sneaker collection 2022. I have not made a YouTube video in such a long time. I have been uploading YouTube shorts, as you guys probably seen if you are subscribed to me. But in today's video, I really just wanted to show you guys some of my sneakers. I have um, a sneaker collection from a couple years back, but I've updated since then, so I kind of wanted to show you guys what I have. Um, I'm just showing you guys like my favorite sneakers and like you know, the ones that I wear the most or like the most hype kind. Um, I know on my Instagram stories, some of you guys voted to see like all of my sneakers, but I just didn't feel as though it was really necessary because the older sneakers are in my first sneaker collection, which I believe was my second video. So you guys can go check that out if you want. Um, and mainly they're just shoes that I don't wear anymore. They're really dirty and messed up. So like, um, those were like vans and stuff like that. So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys the sneakers that I do wear. And without further ado, let's just jump right into the video. So my first pair I have is a brand new pair I'm super excited about. And here they are, this is the box. If you're a sneakerhead, you probably know what these are. And if you've been following me on all my social medias, you've probably seen these, um, but I'm just in love. So, well, let me show you guys. I'm gonna show you guys opening it. So like, okay, okay. Just a little opening here, um, super cute. And then, here they are. I'm in love with these. These are literally just my new favorite pair of sneakers. Um, these are the Off-White Jordan 4s, and I will show you guys close up. I'm just like literally in love. These are just like the best, like just so freaking cute. So here it is. Here's the sneaker up close. Here it is. I just, I'm just in love. Like it's so, I, I don't know what to say. Like I've been needing like outfit inspiration for these shoes. Um, so I have like a black jumpsuit on right now. So I definitely would probably wear like a black jumpsuit. Um, this off, what is this? Um, Stock X um, tag. I'm not sure if I'll keep it on or if I will take it off, but I guess we'll see how I feel and if what it matches. But yeah, I literally love this and I'm gonna keep my tag on. I know a lot of people take theirs off. There's two tags, but I think it just makes the shoe. I, I just look at it as like an accessory for your sneaker. I'm just, I'm just in love. So, and then here's the other one. Here they are. It's kind of hard to show you guys, but I'll just show you individually then. Here's the other one. So, so cute. I'm just, I'm literally in love. Um, these shoes came with obviously like the StockX, you know, information. And then it came with three extra pair of laces. So um, it has a like tan cream pair in now that literally matched so good. And then it came with, I think this is like a white pair. It came with like this mint green because like the bottom where it says Nike is like mint green. And then it also came with a black pair and it obviously says shoelaces on it. So it came with three extra pairs of laces, which I love because um, when sneakers come with extra pair of laces, I'm just like, yes, yes. I just wish like my Air Force Ones came with extra laces because you guys know if you guys wear Air Forces and you've had them for a while, especially any white shoe really, um, they definitely get dirty quick and it's like you definitely need <laughs> more laces for them. So yeah, that's my first pair of shoe. I'm literally so in love. Um, yeah, and if you guys have any like outfit idea inspo, just comment down below, DM me on Instagram. I definitely need outfit inspo for these. They're just beautiful, but I do have a black like jumpsuit on. I wanna get like a long sleeve one, obviously, cause it's fall now. And I think that would be really cute with like these and you know, maybe some, I'm not sure yet, but I definitely know like a little black jumpsuit would really look cute with these. And these would obviously be like the main part to the outfit, if that makes sense. And so now I'm gonna move on to my second pair of shoes. Here they are. These are my Dior sneakers. I got these from the Dior men's store in Soho, New York. Um, it was my first ever time to New York and I literally just went to get these shoes. Um, I was very lucky because they didn't have them anywhere, like at all. So I was so excited when I called and they had them. So I'm trying to show you guys. Oh. All right, I'm going to show you guys like individually, but it comes with like a dust bag. It says Dior on it for the sneakers. Um, it comes with like, you know, your receipt inside and everything. Um, I'm not sure if it only came with one dust bag or if there's two, but I think this is like a two shoe dust bag, right? Maybe it did just come with one. Okay, so here are the sneakers in the box. 
these are my first ever wait these aren't my first these are my second pair of designer sneakers so the first ones i got were my gucci ace ones but these are my second pair of designer sneakers and here they are i'm literally in love i actually did a um unboxing on these on this channel so you guys can go check that out if you want but i'm just like in love like look how beautiful here's the back sorry guys like the laces are out here's the side and then the bottoms are dirty so you know i have the like stuffing in them just to keep them in shape but literally i'm so in love these were actually my most expensive pair of sneakers yeah definitely my most expensive pair um these were at the time one thousand one hundred and fifty dollars which is like crazy insane but we invested for these i'm just in love like i usually wear these with a black jumpsuit and at the moment my prada nylon purse because i don't yet have the dior saddlebag but when i do get the dior saddlebag i think it'll just be beautiful i'm just really excited for that because that's on my wish list right now um and then i have christian dior jewelry i have um the adjustable ring the bracelet and the necklace so i usually just wear that Sometimes I like, you know, wear my Cartier. But um, yeah, these are these sneakers. Here they are together. Sorry guys, like I said, the laces are a little all over the place. But yeah, I'm literally in love with these. They're just amazing. So those are my second pair of sneakers. And these are, sorry guys, the wrapping is so loud, um, and I will link, I can link the sneakers all down below for you guys, um, just in case you guys want to, like, buy, um, but these are the, um, Dior B23 High Top Oblique sneakers, and yeah, these were $1,150 from the Dior Men's Store in Soho, New York, so, yeah, I love those. Next up, we have my Gucci Ace sneakers, so it comes in this little bag. Um, I purchased these, well, my stepdad actually got these for me. Um, he got these at the Gucci store in the King of Prussia Mall. Um, here's the box, and then I'm gonna open this up. And obviously, it's not as neat as it was when I first got it because obviously, like, um, I've been wearing them and things like that, but it does come with two cute little dust bags. Here's one. And then the other one, you could just put your sneakers here. So that's pretty cool. And then the sneakers. So here they are. They're not the cleanest. They're not as clean as they obviously were before. I haven't cleaned them recently, but here they are. So this is like the green one, and this is the red one. So the backs, sorry for the dirt, um, red and green. And this is like a snakeskin look, but there's not real snakeskin. Um, and then, yeah, this is just what they look like. These were my first ever designer pair of sneakers. Don't mind the bottoms. And I'm literally in love. Um, I have, like, certain outfits I wear with this, too. Usually just, like, a black bodysuit turtleneck for the fall or the winter. Black skinny jeans. My Gucci belt. Um, just, you know, the black belt with the two double Gs in gold. And then um, gold jewelry. It's really cute. And then I have this, like, tan blazer coat. I think I actually have a picture of, like... Um, my outfit with these on my Instagram at Trinex Nicole. I will link all my social medias down below that so you guys can follow it as well. Um, so that's like mainly the outfit that I wear with these for fall and winter. But I also have like a summer version like with like black shorts and like this really cute black top. Um, and the Gucci belt, gold jewelry. Um, so yeah, it's really, really cute. I'm in love with these sneakers. Um, they were like my first ever designer pair of sneakers like I said. Um, so yeah, and the packaging came so cute, so well done. Oh my gosh, guys. Sorry I'm so loud. Okay, next on, we're going to be moving on to a more basic pair of sneakers, but still my favorite, one of my favorites. Now we're going on to the Nike Air Force Ones. Um, I feel like everybody has these, but they literally go with everything. I think if you're a sneakerhead or you're just beginning your collection, I think you definitely need to get or have a um, pair of Air Force Ones. So these are my cleaner pair. I do have to clean them. You know, they have like a little bit of brown. I do, oh gosh, I stepped in gum. Okay. I do need to get new laces because as you see, they're not as white as they used to be, obviously. But yeah, here they are. Just your normal Nike white Air Force Ones. And they go with literally everything. So they're just perfect. And then next up I have 
sorry guys, I have my Yeezys, my Yeezy 350s. Um, I don't really wear these much anymore, to be honest with you. They're not really my style anymore. And here's what they look like. These were in my first sneaker collection video, I think. Or maybe they weren't. Maybe I didn't get them yet. But here they are. These are the butter ones. And obviously, they're a little dirty. You know, I have to clean my sneakers. Um, but yeah, I don't really wear these anymore. They're not like my color. Um, and I literally got these because they were like the only ones there. And when I was in school, I wanted a pair of Yeezys so bad. So I was like, I'm just going to get whatever they have. And I didn't even really like these. So uh, make sure like when purchasing things, you're not getting it just to fit in or with the trend. Make sure you really like your sneakers and like your style. It's all about that. Don't try to fit in because I honestly didn't really like this color um, and I spent money on them. Um, at the time I actually wanted like the black and red ones and there was like, um, the like zebra looking ones I wanted. Um, but at the moment I don't really wear Yeezys anymore, but those are my Yeezys. And then next up I have my Jordans. These are my Jordan, what are these? 11s. Um, they are really messed up. My mom literally took these and wore them and mess these up like I don't wear these anymore obviously they're not in style but they're really dirty now like everybody knows me that I'm a sneakerhead and I can't stand if my shoes are dirty but as you see like you know I have a lot of cleaning to do with a lot of my sneakers but my mom literally took these and wore these and just beat them up like ugh. but here they are I love these um but obviously they need to be cleaned. I used to wear these all the time, just nonstop, all the time. These were like my favorite ever, but yeah, here they are. And yeah, those are those. I don't really wear those anymore. And moving on next, we have my Michael Kors slip-ons. Um, let me just move some stuff over so we have some more room. So here these are, these are really cute. Um, I have not worn these in a really, really, really long time, um, but I have like a matching book bag and a matching purse that goes to these, which was really cool. I used to wear these to school because we had like a uniform and like the, um, the jeans that we wore were like tan. So this matched perfectly, but yeah, I got these and they're really, really cute, but, um, yeah, I haven't worn them in such a long time, but yeah, here they are. Here's the detail. They're just like golden brown. They're like really pretty. And they're obviously van style, so yeah, and I love that print. Don't really wear Michael Kors much anymore, but I really like that print. And then last but not least, we have two pairs of boots. I know you guys wanted to see more of my boots, but like I said, um, there was like, it, I don't know how to explain it. Like, there was just like stuff that was in my last sneaker collection in that collection that you guys wanted to see. So like I said, you guys can go check out my other video. I can also probably link that down below for you guys. But it's not far into my channel um, because I don't have a lot of videos. But yeah, next up we have a pair of Uggs. Um, I'm just showing you guys these because I have them. Um, I'm actually, oh my gosh, there's a spider. Okay. Okay. I, why did I know there was going to be a spider? Why did I know that before I even started filming this video? I knew that because... Um, all these sneakers were in my closet for the longest time and I had to take a spider out earlier. So, yeah. <laughs> so, back to what I was saying. These are my Uggs. Um, so I'm not going to purchase any more Uggs because now I finally found out, like, what Uggs are made out of. And if you guys didn't know, I'm vegan. So, yeah, I'm not going to purchase any new pairs, but here they are. Um, and these are just, like, the little Ugg boots with the laces ankle length like a little bit above the ankle these really do keep your feet warm so i have those oh i forgot to show you the other one i like to show you guys them together hold on sorry okay so here they are they're just little boots you know i've had these for a few years now and then last but not least we have one pair of shoes left and these are another pair of uggs here's the box and then just to show you guys these are here they are. Now, what are these called? These are the W Tasman? I don't know. They're like little slippers, but you can wear them out because the bottoms are like, you know, that, what is this? Like uh, shoe material? I don't know how to explain myself today. I'm sorry, guys. But yeah, 
here these are um and i like to wear these in the fall and the winter but obviously if you have uggs you guys know you can't get them wet um they do have like protector for um the waterproof protector for your uggs if it rains or snows but i would never recommend wearing your uggs in the rain or the snow um but yeah these specifically they do keep like your ankles get really cold in these so i'd recommend like wearing fuzzy socks or something if you guys want to get these um but yeah as of right now that's all the shoes i'm going to be showing you guys today um i don't really have anything else that i really like or that's in style at the moment all the other things are like vans and like you know stuff that i don't really wear so i just showed you guys my most hype shoes and then like in the beginning i showed you guys my favorite sneakers like you know my off whites my dior's my air force ones my gucci aces stuff like that so the other ones i don't really wear much but um i don't really have any other sneakers on my wish list at the moment um let me think yeah i don't think i have really anything else on my sneaker wish list at the moment i really did want the um black and white jordan ones but i can't find them anywhere so like i'm kind of just growing out of that right now um and i would totally get more uggs if they were not killing animals and stuff for the uggs you know i, I would totally get more because they're really cute but i'm just gonna have to find some like ugg replicas or dupes because at this point i'm vegan so i can't really get more than that but yeah um so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like this video if you guys enjoyed it. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. I will be linking all the sneakers that are in this video down below in the description box. So you could just, you know, go and click, purchase your shoes. Um, please follow me on my social medias. They will all be linked in the description box down below as well. Please help me get to 400 subscribers by Christmas. That would be great. It would be greatly appreciated. And I just also want to thank you guys for supporting me, following me, commenting on my content, liking my stuff, whether that's here, TikTok, Instagram, Pinterest, wherever it is. I just want to thank you guys because I would not be where I am today without you. So thank you guys so much. And please help me also get to 100K on TikTok. Um, we're at 94.6 thousand followers on tiktok now and that's just like it blows my mind every day when i go on there and i see all the likes and the follows and you know pr package packages and the brand deals and just everything like i really wouldn't be able to be where i am today without you guys so i just wanted to put that out there and i'm also sorry i have not been active here on youtube besides with my youtube shorts um a lot's been going on as you also see um if you guys have been following me this is a new background again but i am moving again so i moved here to a new place, um, my own house. Um, and now I'm moving again, literally tomorrow. So I've been super busy and not been able to make that much content. I've just been been able to make like what I could. So like the YouTube shorts and like certain TikTok videos and things like that, but I have not been able to be as active as I wanna be. So please just be patient with me guys. Um, you know, I will be back. Um, I'm gonna make as much videos tonight really as I can for the next couple weeks, but as of right now that's that's a life update so please guys like i said like this video subscribe if you haven't already and comment down any video ideas you guys have and also comment down your favorite pair of shoes that i have i want to know what your favorite pair is that i showed you guys today all right guys and i will see you in the next video i love you and xo